Hey guys, welcome to an older series on my channel, which died because, well, it's my channel. Things just stop going because I'm lazy. Uh, it's Cthulhu Save the World, as you can see by the title. It's probably in the description. It's, uh, it, I just said it now. If I back out, you might be able to see it on the screen, but uh, yeah. So this this series is pretty much it's an old school RPG game uh, where, you know, it's, it's like turn-based and all that garbage stuff. So we're going to play this, and no, there's no narration. It's literally just going to be me narrating myself. No commentary, please. So, you know, it's going to... I'm, I'm bringing, I'm bringing this, this series back because it's an old classic favorite, and I just loved recording it back in the day. So we're going to see how this goes now with a new microphone quality that isn't ass, like, well, what, 2015? 20, 2016? No, 2015, 2014, I believe. <clears throat> For countless ages, that unthinkable being known as Cthulhu has lain dormant in his underground water of city of Rila. Rila? Ritha? Ulethe? I'm going to say Rila, I guess. Cthulhu, a being so terrible that his mere presence is enough to drive mere mortals insane. Cthulhu sleeps while the world above goes on, oblivious to his own presence. His his presence, not his own presence. What the fuck? Uh, until tonight, I can't fucking read, guys. This is this is terrible. Oh wait, hold on. It's, it's his new voice. <clears throat> Awaken, great Cthulhu. As Cthulhu emerged from the bay, the world seemed doomed indeed. But wait, what's that? A brave and mysterious stranger has appeared from the high top yonder cliff. Using a strange holy power, the mysterious stranger has sealed away Cthulhu's horrible power. His power drained, Cthulhu washes up on the neighboring shore, defeated and dejected. <laughs> After waiting all this time to have a victory snatched from my grasp by a mere mysterious man, it's highly frustrating. I must get my powers back. But how? Uh, Luckily for the world, Cthulhu didn't know the one and only way to break the curse and regain his powers. In order to break the curse and regain his powers, he would have to do the unthinkable. He would have to become a true hero. Only by becoming a true hero would his powers return to him. <laughs> Foolish narrator. Now, you were busy. While you were busy explaining the situation to the player, I was eavesdropping. Now I too know the way to regain my power. Uh, whoops. That's my bad, guys. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry about that, actually. I, Cthulhu, do hereby vow to devote my life to becoming a true hero. and But only so that I can regain my powers to summon Ryla to the surface and destroy the world, of course. And thus, a most unlikely hero was born. Welcome to your new life as a wannabe RPG hero. Before we begin, allow me to give you a few pointers. The great Cthulhu needs no assistance. However, for the benefit of the lowly player who deserves control of me, uh, I will allow you to continue with your feeble tips. Hold the left shift key while moving to run fast. Yeah, okay. Do you, do you want me to do that now? I'm, I'm holding it. I hold. Yeah. Left shift. I'm, I'm doing that. I'm, I'm hitting that button right now, guys. My game just like freaking cold. Ah. Uh. Okay. <laughs> Foolish game developer, but giving me the ability to run. I will finish this silly game in half the time. I'll be able to sell it back to the game store before the trade in. <laughs> what the fuck is Cthulhu talking about? No one fucking uses game stores anymore, dude. This is 2017. What the fuck? Dude, stop. You're t stop, Cthulhu. What, what the fuck? Yeah, that's not gonna happen. Press the tab button to bring up your own menu. From here, you can chat with the members of your party. Check out your stats, start a fight, change your equipment, save the game, or teleport back to cities you visited. I can save at any time. What is this? A first-person shooter? That's pretty. That's that's pretty low. With them. Use abilities like Insanity Slash to combat in combat to make your enemies insane. <laughs> insane enemies take more damage from attacks. But watch out! A few enemies become more dangerous when they're insane. Like my mother. There will be no watching out. I showed Mr. the gift of insanity upon. Oh! 
Build up your combo count with hits. Then unleash a powerful blow. Finish your ability to devastate. I fucking don't care, dude. Are you done yet? This, this is all right with you. I'd like to actually, actually play the game sometime this year. This year. Current year. Good luck. Cosmic monstrosities don't need luck. We you forge our own destinies. No matter what. The cost to humanity. Alright, that hurt my throat more than it should have. Let me drink some water real quick. Alright, now that I embarrassed the fuck out of myself. I'm still like, I'm just, I'm always running apparently. You got three level one-ups. I mean, what the, three one-ups? You can use one-ups. Oh yeah, okay. All right, so we're just gonna run on the beach down here, I guess. And uh, is there like, is there a way to go fast? Because I'm literally running, like I'm base running. Like I don't think the game knows what the f either. My left shift's broken. Hopefully not. Or the game's like glitched, and I'm just always running now. So whatever. <laughs> a helpless maiden, beset by vicious monsters. I should rescue her, thus becoming a true hero. Cause this sounds like a fucking idiot. I swear to God, I can't do a like a spooky monster voice anymore. That would work for a normal person, but you have a lot of evil to atone for. It will take many heroic deeds before you're even remotely close to being considered a true hero. <laughs> then I will kill the monsters anyways, just for the sake of violence. Oh, I love I love violence. It's 2017. I love I love to kill things. Oh, they're doing some damage. You know what? You, you I see some sick moves. I don't have any sick moves, actually. What the fuck? Uh, what about we do uh, insane strike to this mofo? Oh, he's crazy now. I mean, we're gonna do a insane strike to this mofo, and he's dead. And we're gonna fucking beat him. Oh yeah, dude, all the enemies have been defeated, boys. We're level four. All right, level. I uh, see. I could do insane sh uh, d passive ability. Each insane enemy gives you strength. Uh, and, and each insane enemy gives you magic. Uh, I feel like I'm more of a fighter kind of guy. Die, fellow slime monsters. As Cthulhu defeated the, 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 the final slime monsters, he turned his gaze to the maiden that he had rescued. Oh shit, this one. <clears throat> Gorgeous! What? When Umi gazed upon the mighty Cthulhu, she did not see a crazed octopus dragon man. Instead, she saw this. I said the same fucking thing, but with hearts! Warning, image display may not reflect reality. Uh, good. My hero. Hero indeed. Did you hear that? Do I count as a true hero yet? No, you fucking idiot. Blah, blah, blah. At this rate, I shall never become a true hero and regain my cosmic powers of destruction. Oh, brave warrior who just saved me from this gooey death. Let me join you on your noble quest. Oh my god, fucking what the hell. <laughs> do you uh, do you do anything besides get attacked by slime monsters? I have an affinity with the creatures of the sea and called then my friend what the, is she fucking aqua woman? God damn it dude. Pass. Yeah, me too actually. I, yeah, I'll fucking <clears throat> Oh I have this trident which I use to stab things. That's more like it. And above all, I Umi promise you my wholehearted love and devotion. You great big green hunk of handsomeness. Yeah, the great Cthulhu requires groupies. Uh, you sure do. Yeah! Does this mean we're dating now? What the fuck, dude? Oh my god. No, we're, <laughs> we're strictly in a rock star groupie relationship. Yeah, that's, that's what I'll call it. For now. <laughs> Umi has joined your party. <laughs> Now, now, now that you have a second party member, you can use your chat command. You can also use multi-character, unite techniques in battle, gain more abilities, and allies. I fucking uh, kept to the random encounters are now active in this dungeon. After fighting 25 battles in this area, random encounters you will be turned off. Oh, okay, that's pretty cool. If you like to fight beyond that path, uh, dude, I don't want to do that actually at all. Oh yeah, let's fucking fuck some bitches up, boys. I talked to... Uh, what's going on? Is that a uh, lifestyle fish in your hair? Yes, his name is Penta. Isn't he cute? A lifestyle fish in your hair. And people think I'm disgusting. The town of Miskatonia is just past a series of caves. I'm sure there are some heroic deeds you could do there. 
to Miskatonia. Oh, uh, I'll save here. All right, easy cave, easy life, boy. Is there anything over there? I think there's like uh, maybe. Is this the same way around? No, it's fucking dead end. Actually, what the fuck? I got baited. 